Hello, I'm David Chaston with 989, brought to you by interest.co.nz. This is where you get everything you need to know in 90 seconds at 9 o'clock with news of a crisis brewing in China and a mess in Greece. China's stock markets face a make or break week after their government rolled out a major set of measures over the weekend to prevent an all out stock market crash. They've frozen new share offers and brokers there have set up a $20 billion market stabilisation fund. These events have shaken China's aura of invincibility as more than 2.8 trillion in value has been wiped off Chinese share market values in the past 20 days. Their central bank was also reported to be ready to pump in funds for what is needed to stabilise these financial markets. It is a very dangerous situation, although Chinese stock markets are not as central to their economy as, say, Wall Street and London are to the economies of the US and Europe. On top of that, the Greek threat to markets just crystallised. The first official projections of their referendum outcome said that more than 60% of Greeks had voted no to creditors' demands yesterday, an outcome that will set the country on a collision course with the rest of the Eurozone. One thing is likely though, a no vote won't end or resolve anything. Negotiations are likely to drag on over what it all means. But it does greatly raise the chance that there will be a Grexit at some point. A lot will depend on market reactions when they open in New York after the long holiday weekend. In New York at the end of last week, US Treasury 10-year benchmark yield fell a little and will open today at 2.39%. Local swap rates sank at the short end with their two-year rate now below 3% for the first time in two years. The 210 curve is approaching 100 basis points, something we haven't seen since March 2014. US oil markets will start the week very much lower with the US benchmark price now just over $55 a barrel and Brent crude just over $60 a barrel. The gold price is also slightly lower at $1167 an ounce. The Kiwi dollar opens today at 66.9 US cents and that is almost a six year low at 89.2 Aussie cents which is up almost one cent from Friday as the Aussie dollar is taking the brunt of the Chinese drama and at 60.3 euro cents. The TW night is now at 71.1, itself almost a three year low. I'm David Chaston. That was 90 at 9 brought to you by interest.co.nz.